So 1.2 says to us, illustrated below are steps and some instructions to assemble a deck chair. Please, please, please um, remember to also go and study some questions on assembling. They are quite simple, um, but it's also good to practice. To assemble the deck chair, the wooden pieces are joined together using fasteners. So the fasteners are screws, bolts, washers, and nuts. They are 32 pieces. So we've been given the total number of pieces that are in this um, set over here. And it says the packet of fast in the packet of fasteners, each bolt is secured by a nut and a washer. So that means that that information is going to be valuable some way, somehow. So it says steps to assemble. We've got step one, step two, step three, and step four. So it goes like this. It goes um, in clockwise form and it ends over here. So it starts over here and ends over there. There we go. So when we are first assembling it, it says to us there BDE, A, and then we have to then have the instruction also given here, which says that we need to attach the C to using bolts B and nuts E and washers D to the front legs. So when it comes to assembling questions, I don't panic that much because I know that you are going to kill it. Let's answer the questions. So we've got screw A. It, it, it's so, it actually just gives us everything in like exactly the way it is. So screw A looks like that. Then bolt B looks like that. And C, bolt C looks like that. Washer D, nut E. And then the quantity simply tells us how much of each they are. Look at that. I can already put an X over there because I can see I'll probably be asked to calculate what's going on over there. And then I've got eight of those and eight um, of those as well. So it says here that we need to determine the number of type C bolts used to assemble the deck. Can you see already type C is this one that I was talking about. We are given the total, which makes it really easy. So the total that we are given, um, according to this, is that we've got 32 in total. And that's the total that we have. We've got 32 in total. So because we've got 32 um, in total, that simply means that we are going to subtract these numbers. And that's going to give us um, the answer for C. So let's do that. So we've got 32 in total, and then we're going to subtract the other ones that we are given, which is 8 plus 6 plus 8 plus 8. Okay, so we put that in our calculator and we get the following. 32 minus 8 plus 6 plus 8 plus 8 plus 8. Close your brackets, and that gives you 2 of type C. So you can just say two type C or you can say two bolts. Okay, there we go. State the number of nuts left over after step one is completed. Let's go and read step one because step one will tell us how many of them we need. So we need to know how many um, of Nuts. So we need to know the number of nuts left over, okay, after step one, which should be very interesting to find out because nuts in total, we've got eight nuts in total. And then after step one, step one tells us that we are going to use how many of these after step one. So for step one, it means that we need to go and say how many of them we have. So nut E looks like this. And if nut E looks like that, that means this is nut E over there. So it means that we are going to be using how many of those. We need to go and calculate how many of them we are going to find. So I see one and two. 
meaning that we are going to subtract them from the total number. So if we are going to... Hmm. After step one, that's going to be one, two, three, four, five, and six. So that's eight minus six. So if I've got eight in total, and I use up six of them, then I'll have two left. Okay. Name the last piece required to complete the assembly of the deck. So for us to complete um, the deck, look at this. Out of all these other um, ones, we don't have this particular piece, which is being mentioned here. So this is the piece that we are going to need. Because look, that's a long brace. Do you see? So meaning that over and over again, we are shown the long brace, and then at the very end, we are then shown the short brace. So this requires quite a lot of um, your attention. So that is the short brace. 